Hello, I'm Christina, and uh, this is my introduction video. Um, I don't have a lot of fancy editing software, so I'm going to keep this pretty simple. Um, my history in art and education. I recently finished my BA at Texas A&M Commerce, and it was kind of a mixture of uh, studio and art history. Um, I initially thought I wanted to be a professional artist, um, but as I uh, started doing art history, I thought that might not be the quite thing for me. Quite the thing for me, so I kind of started going towards a more academia-centered um, degree, and uh, I thought that I wanted to do museum studies um, and art education. So that's how I got here. Um, I'm currently doing a graduate assistantship with uh, the art appreciation classes. So, um, my history in education. Besides that, uh, I've done several years of summer camps and um, community theater um, as a leader. That is. And uh, I also recently did a internship at the Tyler Museum of Art um, in their art education uh, department. So um, I'm primarily interested in art history and museum work, although uh, I do my own um, studio work too sometimes, um, which is primarily painting and uh, mixed media. I don't have anything to show you, I'm sorry, I just moved here, <laughs> so I don't have a lot with me. Um, but to give you an idea of what kind of things I like, um, some of my favorite artists are Van Gogh, uh, James Enser, um, there are a lot of digital artists I really like. Um, there's a illustrator named Brom, who I think is pretty amazing. Uh, he does um, illustrated books. Um, I also like Jean Michel Basquiat and uh, Pete Montreon. Those are some of my favorites. So, uh, what really gets me going uh, as an art making? Um, what really gets me going? Um, I'm really interested in. Um, psychology and horror <laughs> in art, uh, the personal themes, personal relationships that uh, um, have an impact on an artist's work, um, and how intense and visceral that can be. But I also love um, beautiful works that are about <laughs> um, harmony and uh, finding order within chaos. So those are some of the things that interest me, I guess. Uh, uh, let's see. Three things that really capture and hold your attention. Um, I gotta say, music is a really big deal to me, besides art. I spend a lot of time listening to music. Uh, and especially experimental music that um, is kind of unusual, I suppose. Uh, second thing would be film. I really enjoy film. I haven't, uh, I don't have a lot of time to watch just new films, but um, there are some films that I've seen that, that have had a great impact on me, and I feel they made a impression kind of like on my consciousness and how I see things and I think that's what a good film can be about is having an impact on the audience um, and their whole worldview. Um, third thing, I'm a really big reader. I read a lot, <laughs> not just uh, uh, you know articles and things but um, sci-fi, horror, fantasy, historical fiction. I'm really into history. I love history, <laughs> especially art history. Um, 
and uh, I think medieval art would be my favorite um, in that regard. So, but I think contemporary um, art also has a lot to offer in terms of discussion and uh, rhetoric, interesting topics to talk about. So, um, that's uh, the end of the video, I guess. Uh, I look forward to working with you all and getting to know you, and I hope this will be a great class. So, nice meeting you.